Hello, I'm Ben and I am in my five by four meter Dunster House log cabin. It's been here for about five weeks now. I've been working here running my business full time. When this was being built at the bottom of my garden, I couldn't find loads of good YouTube content talking about how much it cost. How big is it? What does it look like when you try and decorate one of these things? How do you maintain it? Is it freezing cold? Does it get filled with spiders? So far there's no spiders and other questions like that. There just wasn't anything on YouTube. So I thought I would make my own video content. I've got some stuff lying around, cameras and bits and pieces from work. And I wanted to just answer some of the questions that I had when I first built it. So let me show you first which cabin I've got. So this is the Dunster House website and they are a brand that seems to be very well known. I was recommended to use them. The total came to just under 6,000 pounds for this because I added insulation, um, paid for the hex shingles, Lots of extras, special paint. I think in hindsight, you probably could get a bunch of this stuff yourself for cheaper, but it was just easier to get it from a single person and just have it all arrive. Um, 5,800 pounds-ish it was, and it took about 60 days to arrive. But let's go outside and have a look at it. As you can see, it's not quite finished yet. We're waiting to plant the area outside of the cabin and lay turf after the winter, but we've made some amazing progress, which I couldn't have done without all of the help from some amazing friends who have been landscaping and shaping the garden, as well as the builders. But we're here to talk about costs. So after I'd cleared the garden, a local builder came in and excavated the footprint for the cabin. They dug a trench and laid armored cables underground for ethernet and power lines. Um, they built the shuttering and then they pumped in the concrete uh, for the base. And then they built the cabin. And finally, an electrician came in to wire everything up. In total, they spent five or six days on the build from start to finish. And all of that cost about 5,000 pounds all in. So in total, it was about £10,000 to get this cabin, which would have been an empty, unfurnished thing that needs decorating, which we'll talk about another time. If you've got any DIY skills, you could definitely reduce that cost, but I don't. And I paid a local firm who I really like. They're nice guys, and they did a really good job on getting this up and, and ready for me. I hope that helps. Uh, there will be more videos about heating, about maintenance, what it's like to work here, uh, how you decorate it, some ideas and stuff like that. So stay tuned, and I'll see you soon.